In this video, I'm going to show you one of the best upgrades that you can get for PlayStation. Recently, I've been testing several different external hard drives for both the PS5 as well as the PS4, and it turns out you can actually get better performance and load times by using an external SSD with certain games. I'm currently testing the Samsung T7 SSD to store and play most of my PS4 games, and if you're using an external SSD with the PlayStation 4, you can actually get much faster load times in-game versus the standard PS4 hard drive. The real difference between between an external SSD and a hard drive is the performance benefits you get with using an SSD. Not only do games load and run faster while using this, but you can also download games and copy data to them a lot quicker as well. For some people, a big reason why this would be a better choice than a built-in SSD for PS4 is because when you're ready to upgrade to a PS5 from the PS4, all you gotta do is just disconnect the SSD from the PS4 and plug it into the PS5's USB Type-C port. And just like that, you'll have easy access to all of your PS4 games ready to go at peak performance if you ever wanted to play them again. There's no need to re-download or reinstall anything because this is portable, whereas the PS4's hard drive is not. Now you might ask yourself why pay the extra money for an external SSD when you can just get a regular external hard drive to do the exact same thing for much cheaper. Well the truth is they are both great options but it all comes down to performance. This is going to run games just as fast as the standard built-in PS4 hard drive at a lower cost, but this will run games a whole lot Lot faster, much like a built-in SSD. In fact, I was able to cut down load times by using this external SSD versus a standard external hard drive. Another benefit is you do not need to reinstall the system software when using an external SSD, because if you ever thought about upgrading your PS4 with an internal SSD, it's not exactly plug and play. You would actually need to reinstall the system software from a USB drive to the internal SSD in order to even use it. So for people who might not be as tech savvy or have access to a computer, Computer, an external SSD ends up being a much better option. You just plug it into the PS4, download your games, and benefit from faster performance. Once you upgrade to the PS5, just plug it into the front-facing USB-C port and take full advantage of even faster performance. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video and you found it useful or at least interesting, and if you did, make sure to leave a like rating, comment below to let me know what you think, and as always, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for post notifications. I'll see you next time.